Good afternoon from your best car in Kent. My name is Ben. I'm from one of our two UK branches. We're in Cranbrook, 10 miles outside of Tunbridge Wells, or just a 40 minute train commute from London. Our other site is in Buckinghamshire near Marlow, and combined we have over 600 five star reviews. So please check out our website to see those reviews from our happy customers and, of course, the rest of our fleet. Before I get into the walk around, I'd just like to answer the two most frequently asked questions that we get here, which are, do we take part exchanges and do we offer finance? The answers are both yes and yes, we will take your part exchange. We can even pay off outstanding finance on your current car. Then on top of that, I'm thrilled to say that we are industry beating with our low APR finance rates. So if finance is the review, then please get in contact with us or you can visit our website, yourbestcar.co.uk, where we have a finance calculator at the bottom of every advert. So whether it's PCP or HP that you're after, you can input some numbers to that calculator, adjust the filters, find something that works for you, then there'll be a finance breakdown of that contract before you hit apply. So this is the walk around video for our Audi Q3 SE presented in monsoon gray metallic exterior paint. This Q3 has the 1.4 liter petrol engine producing 150 brake horsepower, also capable of achieving up to 54 miles per gallon. It's also Euro 6 compliant. So with this model, you're getting the perfect blend of performance and economy returns. But not just that, as you've already seen from the advert and the attention grabber, this Q3 comes with a lot of upgrades. So a credit to its previous one owner from you, it's been spec perfectly from the start. That includes the technology pack, the comfort pack, and the leather, or the part leather for Alcantara sports seats. One of my favorite upgrades is actually down here, the 18 inch five spoke dynamic design alloy wheels. Of course, all of the package breakdowns and maintenance history will be listed in the description. So this is a five door. There's um, aluminium or chrome roof rails along with the chrome window surrounds, just to break up the gray. And let's have a hop inside. So here we go. This is what I mean by the seat upholstery. These, the leather, Alcantara seats, the comfiest available from this generation of Q3, in my opinion. It doesn't get too hot in the summer, nor too cold in the winter, as you haven't got a full leather seat upholstery. It's also retained its brand new car smell pretty well, in all honesty, too. You've got rubber floor mats down below, and then the driver has a leather-wrapped multi-function steering wheel. You've got your paddle shifters tucked behind for your gear shift paddles, switching it into your semi-automatic mode. You've then got cruise control tucked behind here. Then your voice control, multimedia buttons, and hands-free functions. Then in the middle is your retractable 6.5 inch infotainment display. This gives the car undoubtedly a, a retro and minimalistic feel once you flatten it down. And then your in-car entertainment system buttons are in the middle. So let's have a hop inside and we'll run you through some of these features. Just to show you this in-car entertainment system. That can be clicked down like so, and then open up again. So I've included photos in the advert description, well, the advert photos as well. So uh, we'll just run through what you might have already seen. So this is your main menu. If we start with tone, this adjusts the bass, the treble, uh, some sound systems for your multimedia system. And then speaking of multimedia, you've got radio built in, so FM, AM, and DAB radio. So digital stations are on here too. You can then also connect up your phone via Bluetooth to play your own music. You can also connect up via USB. If you just have a look at source at the top, we can see we can connect up via these outlets. You've also got your SD card reader as well, along with your MP3 and CD player down below. Oh, to navigation. So SatNav is built in. Then we've got our map view here. We can use these dials down here to zoom in and out on the map so we can see our point of interest. And then one over the info. So this is just our traffic information for the satellite navigation. And then onto telephone. So also via Bluetooth, this is where we connect up our hands free. So we'll have our contacts on here. We can make calls straight from our phone book. We can receive calls, of course, as well. We can use the buttons on the steering wheel to help us out with that. So we can keep our phone tucked away whilst driving when using our multimedia and hands-free use. 
Then onto car, this has our driver select mode. So we've got efficiency, comfort. Efficiency is really good for achieving those high miles per gallon, so perhaps on the motorway. And then dynamic, you've got that sportier kick as well if you need it. Moving on to systems, this will show you if there's any issues with the car in terms of your servicing. Uh, you might have a flat tire or the tire pressure is low. You'll always get an alert on here just to let you know. So down below, as I've already mentioned, your multimedia controls along with your CD and uh, MP3 player. And then down below here, your climate controls. So you've got a dual zone climate control. Here's the intensity in the middle and then separate temperatures for the left and right hand side. I also forgot to show you, we've got reversing sensors as well as a reversing camera. Our gear stick is down below. I've left your lock and wheel nut just here and you've also got an electronic handbrake and then under the armrest, just some more storage. Up above as well, it's worth pointing out, the previous owner has left their dash cam. All it needs is an SD card. So that's it for the front cabin. Let's have a look at the rest of the car now. Of course, we've got the exact same seat upholstery back here. So you've got the Alcantara backings of the seats and the rubber protective mats down below. Of course, it's completely up to you what you do with these rubber mats. And then in the middle, your air con, or your air vents rather. The big plus of the Q3 is just how much room you get. So you can see plenty of headroom and leg room, and you can collapse these rear set of seats too. Moving on to the rear really handsome rear end of the car. We can open the boot like so and again just like the passenger space plenty of room back here in the boot. As I've said you can flatten the rear seats I'll show you that in just a second. You've got a parcel shelf which can be taken off as well and then underneath this compartment either your false floor area but most importantly your spare wheel. So you have got some additional storage down there with the spare wheel and over here to the seats. So if I just give a quick demonstration on how all these are folded down, it's really simple. You might've already seen this from the advert photos, what all of them look like flattened down. Just gives you that extra bit of space should you need it. So if you're interested in buying the Audi Q3, then please give us a call on 01580 712 115, or you can send us an email to sales at yourbestcar.co.uk. As I mentioned at the beginning of the video, we take part exchanges and offer finance packages. So if either of those options apply to you, then please let us know. We're all accessible on iMessage or the Meta platforms, so Facebook, Instagram, or WhatsApp. So if you have any questions or queries about our cars, or you might have some details of your part exchange to send to us, then please feel free to message us on those platforms instead, if it's a little bit more convenient. So thank you for taking the time to watch this video and best of luck with your search for a new car.